The airdrop I'm going to talk about in this video is going to make you between $1,000 to $5,000 in the next few months when they launch. The platform I'm going to talk about in this video is called Bera Chain. They actually raised over $100 million, which is one of the biggest amount raised by any crypto project in 2024. So if you are paying their airdrop, then you are missing out on a lot. So in this video, I'm going to show part of the step-by-step -step guide on how you can actually position yourself for this airdrop from the very beginning till the end so that you don't miss out on this airdrop. So if you like videos like this, make sure to like this video and subscribe to this channel. Let's get to it. Before getting started with this video, here are the requirements. So the number one thing you need is your MetaMax wallet. You can actually do that on your phone or on your mobile device. Now, if you want to do that on your phone, simply go to Play Store or App Store and then install Mrs. Browser. And then once you're done installing Mrs. Browser, kindly go ahead and follow through with the next step I'm doing in this video. And if you also using your laptop, you can follow me to do the next step right in this video. So go ahead and set your MetaMax Chrome extension. Yeah, right on your phone or on your PC. In case you are done installing the Mrs. Browser, go ahead and search for this MetaMax Chrome extension right there. And click on this first one over here. And go ahead and click on Add to Chrome. So once you do that, it will automatically done. And you'll be prompted to create your wallet. That is, if you don't have a wallet, you can have. But if you have a wallet, then proceed with me in the next step. All right, so first, I'm going to come to this website, atio.forsets.parachain.com. I'm going to leave all links in the description. So first you click on I have read. So you're going to click on I have read and accept it. Click on agree. So right here, what you're going to do is go back to your MetaMax wallet. Copy your wallet address. And then come here. And you're going to paste your wallet address right here. So next you click on verify you are a human. And that's done. Now click on drift tokens. I can see request submitted. So this should enter my wallet in the next two minutes. All right. All right. So since we are done with that, now there are certain times whereby you can request for a token and you must not see them. What you can simply do is you can scroll down and try out these other platforms. So this first one over here, click on money, on the Java faucet, and it's going to open up in a new page. You can also request for faucets in this platform because you actually need faucet token to do this airdrop. If you don't have faucet token, there is nothing you can actually do in this airdrop at all. So when you come here, just click on about it. And you know why like click on it for next wallets. The next MetaMax. Click on next, click on connect, and click on approve. And click on switch. So right here, we can check if you have any better tip than two. Right here you can see I am zero. I've not received it yet. So what I'm gonna do is um, and I come here and claim it, but you can see what is showing here is claim is under maintenance. So right, I can actually claim any better to both of this platform. I can come back and then try this more often and see if I will receive the token. But if not, I'll go back and I can try this next one over here, which is quick note for set that click on it. And what I'm going to do is to connect our wallet. So I click off the next wallet and select MetaMax. And our wallet is connected. So I'll click on continue. I can actually receive more token by logging in and then doing some stats. Well, I'll just click no thanks, just send me 0 0.1 bearer. I can see my transaction is going to suit. You can actually try out any of these three methods. One of them wants to work for you and then you can continue with me and it's the next step in this video. Right, so now I've actually received the token in my wallet. Now the next thing I'm going to do is to try out each of some of these platforms over here. So let's start with Bex. We'll click on Bluetooth app. And the next thing I'm going to do is to connect to our wallet. I select MetaMax. And our wallet is connected. So next I'm going to click on Swap Tokens. And over here, I'll put in the token I want. So first I want Vera. And I want to swap it for STUSDC. So I'll put in the amount 0 0.001. Don't do it with small amounts, don't do a lot so that you don't exhaust your token one immediately. Alright, so next I'm going to click on preview and I'll click on swap. And I'll click on confirm. So my transaction is actually going through. And you can see it has its successful. Alright, so the next thing is to swap this token for honey. So I'll select honey. And next, I'll just put in the amount. So this is 0 0.003. Or like zero zero nine or something, and click on preview. Then I'll click on swap. 
and that's who you also go through and right now you can see i've actually swapped for two tokens so far so the next thing i'm going to do is to use the pull section over here. so i click on pull all right so this is the pull section and i'll come to the pull section i will select that 50 xtg and 50 bearer i'll click on add so right here i'm just going to click on max so the moment i click on max i can come here and do 0 0.001 and I can click on preview. Okay. So next, I'll click on approve infinite. All right. So next, I'm going to click on add liquidity. And I'll click on confirm. And our liquidity is actually adding right there. I can close it, but it's going to happen automatically by itself. And that is basically the step to add liquidity on vexed.bera chain. All right. So I'm going to go back to this website. And the next thing I'm going to do is to try out this next platform, which is bearer chain native stable coin what here i'm going to click on go to all right so the next thing i'm going to do is click on i have read click on i agree and i'm going to connect my wallet so you can do that from here or from here so just click on connect wallet select metamax click on next click on con connect and that has gone through all right so the next thing to do is i need to get more stg usdc to go to i actually use that to provide liquidity in the last platform i talked about so i'll go back to the pull section pick on swap and select bear rat now over here i'm going to select um std usdc and i'll just type 0 0.01 click on preview click on accept price chain click on swap so in case anytime you're doing this your token finishes you can always go and swap to get more tokens, click on confirm. And I'll just wait for my transaction to go through. I'll go back to the holy page. And once my transaction is confirmed, then I can proceed with this. So it can be a transaction success. So I'll go back to the holy website and I'll just refresh this page again. I can see I have some tokens here. So I can just buy a plus like four tokens. And I will click on approve infinite, click on next, click on approve, and next I'm gonna click on mint and I'll click on confirm. So that is actually going through right now. I can see if transaction successful, so I can close this and go back to this bear chain for search website. And now I can try out any other of these platforms. So let's go with Bend. I'll click on go to app and it'll open up. So first I'll click on uh bread accepted, click on our three. Now I'm going to click on connect, select Metamax. I click on next, click on connect, and that's done. So over here, what I'm going to do is to click on borrow Honey. So I'll click on supply, and I can just do, let's say, three Honey. Click on approve infinite, click on next, click on approve, and now I'm going to click on supply, and I'll click on confirm. So that is going through it. Okay, so that was successful. I'll close this. So I can go ahead and deposit all of the money I have. I'll click on supply again. And just click on max, click on supply, click on confine. And the transaction is successful. And I'll go back. And the way, what I'm just going to do is to refresh this page. And at the moment, I'm not really allowed to um, borrow any token. Yes, I, I can actually borrow, but I can always come back. And then if there's a borrow section where I say I can click on borrow and all of that. I went out to withdraw, I can also click on withdraw. Put the amount I want to withdraw and then click on withdraw. And that's where you go through. All right, so next I'm going to go back here. And we're done with this three section. So next, let's try out BEPS. I'm going to click on go to app. And first I'll click on uh, red, click on agree. And I'm going to click on start treating. So next I'm going to click on connect, select Metamax. Click on next, click on connect, and that's done. All right, so next, you can see I actually need some money tokens to do this. So what I'm going to do is to also go back to the Bex website and swap some of my bear up to honey. And so I can actually use that to convey in this video. So let's say I'll do 0 0.03. Click on preview, click on swap. Now, in case it is actually building, you can actually click on this over here and then change it to aggressive so that you your transaction will go uh will come will be completed very fast so i'll click on confirm so we show the transaction field i can play the game i'll just click on preview click on accept price change click on swap 
uh, and I can make it aggressive and uh, click on it going farm and that's actually good I can also open up my meta max and I can click on speed up click on these put it on our hundred percent increase click on submit and then I just come back and leave it so that too we our transaction might end up going faster than um, expected that was successful all right so I'm gonna go back to the BEPS web websites so when I came here, it says minimum collateral is 10 money. So what I'm going to do is I'll go back and swap for more tokens and get um, six more money. And then that should be enough to complete this. So I'll go to the swap section and swap for 0 0.03. I'll click on preview. I'll click on swap. And I'll click on confirm. Right, so that's done. So I'll go back to... Beps and then I can now put in 10 money and then after I 10 money and I can use any leverage of my choice alright so I'll click on place market long and I need to confirm the transaction so the transaction fee is 0 0.26 bearer and I actually don't have off to that amount of bearer to open in my wallet so the thing I can do is to convert and request for bearer tokens which is in this website over here. I'll just come over here on the FISA wallet address and request for it. And I click on a new man. But you can see that I cannot do that every eight hours. I can't do that more than eight hours. So I have to wait for the next eight hours to continue this step. But since we have enough token, we can go ahead to do other steps and then all we have to more better to think we can continue with this step. So I'll just scroll down and then let's try out the next goal, which is bgt station i click on go to app and i'm gonna click on have red click on agree i'll click on connect wallet click on meta max and I click on next click on connect all right so that is done so i can click on governance and in right here i can click on this very first one here so i'll just click on vote click on yes all right so you can see i don't i currently don't have any voting power because i don't have a lot of token so what i'm going to do is always come back request for better tokens the more i have the more i am eligible to actually vote here but because i don't have enough of it then i can't actually do anything right away so that is it on the bgt station but next one is better tail which is not really necessary it's just, it's just what it does is to tell you each of the transactions that have been done on this particular blockchain and all of that so it's not really necessary for you now to the last thing which is the galaxy campaign tax so what you're going to do here is to connect your wallet select ethereum click on switch and that's done so what you're going to do is to do this social tax over here and it will ask you to follow better chain you're going to follow them and that this will be done same with this one and that is basically all you're going to be doing here and that's makes you eligible for this airdrop and the final thing you can also try out to visit this particular page so once you're done with that that is basically all of the steps to position yourself for this airdrop so guys this is all of the steps on how to position yourself for this airdrop now i know that it is way way complicated and you can feel free to ask me any question in the comment section and don't forget to join my telegram channel where you also have access to send me any question about choice and i'll be there to reply you in my telegram channel and if you like videos like this make sure to like this video and subscribe to this channel and i'll see you in my next video